Hi everybody, welcome to the latest fan cam. So before we get on with the fan cams, as usual, no, get downloading the One Football app. It is free. The link is in the description for that. All the latest news, your transfers, your gossip, stats with Newcastle United. Every football fan needs it. Tell us about your adventures in Australia, first of all, then. Oh, it was uh, brilliant, man. Um, great seeing all the sightseeing. The weather was hot, but ridiculously hot as well. Well into the late 30s, going into the 40s as well. So Did you come back to this? Yes, come back to crappy UK northeast weather, hi. Well, you must. This is a nice present for you to come back, though. Oh, it is definitely because of all the negativity that's going on, like the outside of the club now. Rumours going around that the takeover could be coming off soon, because of um, looks like it's going to be Ash it's Ashley's asking price that is putting people off from uh, buying the club. What a what a result! What a what a great performance! Rondon was especially outstanding. It's awful to be honest. We we didn't turn up. It's a bit. It's our big game as well. The same as you, but uh, it's, it was really annoying. We. Uh, I thought our right back, yeah, uh, your Richie, was, he was targeted him all the time, and he he was really poor. And we tried getting someone in, but we, we need to try and get someone in now because I thought he was awful today. And strike force, I, I, it wasn't great, you know. We, uh, service was all right, but we just couldn't seem to get going from the off, and it's really disappointing. What about Fabian Shaw and his uh, brace against the? The mighty bluebird. Oh well, he was he was also up there. He was he was tremendous today, and I couldn't quite believe that he, they got two goals. But I'm not complaining. Whether they go off off his thigh, his ass, I, I don't really care. As long as they go in. 2:45. Where were you at 2:45? Oh, are you on about when I was late? <laughs> I thought I thought the team dealt with the pressure really well. I think the first time the first goal was crucial, and when we got the first goal, it it, it relaxed us. It relaxed us a bit a bit more. I'm just surprised at uh, how easy it was for us, I think. Uh, the first time we've scored uh, three goals in the league game since the uh, last year of last season. Yeah, brilliant victory. Um, fully we deserved. I thought we played much better today than we have in recent weeks. Uh, again, the atmosphere, yeah, there was a couple of Ashley chants, but um, I thought relatively that was the best atmosphere this season. Um, and hopefully that's confidence going ahead um, into the next couple of games. Um, yeah, brilliant from Short. And that was an absolutely brilliant goal to run past, like literally all the defenders over pressure and scoring. I, I think I think for the players, I think it relaxed. I don't think the fans did, but I, I especially was after the second goal. I think we could relax as fans and realise that we're gonna we're gonna win this. And I was confident we did. That shot goal, that is probably the most surprising thing I've seen. Ben you know, I, I said the back, exactly. I've seen something like happen. Ben Sharper, oh yeah. I mean, could Joss Lou do that? <laughs> no. I mean, <laughs> put you off front, mate. He, he scored two goals a day, class. I mean, yeah, it's just an all round class performance, mate. Couldn't ask for more. I mean, Southampton won the day, but we needed that win, especially at home where we haven't been able to win as of recent. I think, I think, he has, I think he's really stepped up since he came in. I think he's a, possibly head of, maybe ahead of Shelby now in the pecking order and I think when Diarmi's fit I, I don't I think Hayden would move aside although Hayden had a good game today. But I, I'm really impressed with Long at the moment. I think that's good. I think Lejeune Chan in particular, they fit this uh, formation. Um because we were playing I thought actually Lejeune's gonna uh, do really well in this. When he comes back. Very surprised about uh, how uh, poor Cardiff were the day. Um, sounds like Warnock was con concentrating more on Brexit than his actual team the day, actually. Because I've seen the post that's been going around. You're uh, a fan of Brexit? Oh, no. I think it's one complete mess, in my opinion. You would stay in the EU? Yeah, definitely. I would stay in the EU, right? Yeah, you have to win that because you're in relegation. Yeah. And now we, we, we have. Re I, I, I haven't seen a result, but I think we're in the bottom three now, so. You know, we need to start winning now. Obviously, if we're in the bottom three now, it's really, it's really poor now. We, we need to get, get in our act together, otherwise we're just going to stay down there now for the rest of the season. I mean, for Dubravka, he had a good game, like, catching the crosses, but that's all he really had to do. He didn't really have to, like, any, make any, like, spectacular... No fight from them, was it? Well, exactly. The, the, they were poor, but in return, we were excellent. We shut them down every chance, half chance they had. We shut down through Lejeune and Shaw. They didn't have a look in, mate. We didn't give them a chance. Showed professionalism. We didn't lose concentration at any point. You know, it's one of those games where you'd snatch your hand off if you were offered a 1-0 a win, scrappy 1-0 win. But it was anything but. I mean, it could, could have been more, but I'm, I'm not going to nitpick on that. 3-0, man. First time we've scored more than twice in a league game this season. 
and a performance, man. I mean, we did not give Cardiff um, an element of chance today. You know, we, we took the game to them from the first whistle and, and at the end, 3-0. Couldn't have asked for more from the lads. And hey, Fabian Shah, what? Wait, that is the first time in my lifetime, if I'm not mistaken, that a Newcastle defender has scored more than once in a game. It's got to be Fabian Shaw for me, the day. Um, the way he took that first goal was unbelievable. And you're thinking... He's you, a defender? Ah, you're a defender. You're thinking you would, that would normally be like a Messi or Ronaldo doing that. But coming from a defender of all time and getting two goals a day as well. I never expected that at all. But fantastic game all the way around. Man of the match for me. We've got a mountain to climb now to start to get out of that bottom three now. So, yeah, it's a huge setback on our confidence as well, not just that we're in the bottom three, you know, with the whole morale. So, we have to, set, we have to get it back going again because otherwise we're going to just stay down there for the rest of the season. And, you know, we don't want that. I, I want Premier League football next year again. Absolutely amazing. 3 0. That's what we needed. We needed a confidence booster with Perez scoring again. He scored midweek. Hopefully he can turn out to be good this season. And also Fabian Shaw, unbelievable. De defending as well, but he can even score. So, and he played midfield midweek and I thought he played really well in midweek in midfield. So maybe midfield is his way to go. You know, it's a big game next week, but um, yeah. We can go out, we're not on the bottom three anymore, are we? No. So we can, so we've got some, some confidence, you know what I mean, going into the next game. It'd be really good to have a nice cup run. I really hope we can have a really good cup run this season. Um, it would be really nice to have a cup run, so yes, I, I would love to win. A replay would be inconvenient, but yeah, in terms of the league, yes, we can look at that as the pressure's off. The pressure's off, we're going to come back in 10 days' time for, for another league game. But yeah, today has, has, been, has lifted a lot of pressure off us today. And yeah, that, that's what we're looking forward towards, isn't it? You know, safety in the league. Yes, the league's a priority, but at the same time, a cup run. I, I'd, I'd love to have, but I, it, it's, it's worth sacrificing the cup for safety in the league. That's paramount.